10th of April, we were with Mick Rock in Berlin. Schwarzkopf and Schwarzkopf Publishers. Right now. However, we've got to kick it off with something. And again, I'm thinking another picture, because about a blank page, we need it all. Bang, 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 bang. Something. Maybe one more double page spread. Can, can we handle that? What do we think? Or maybe a couple of little black and white things, or one bigger, one smaller. Oh, I think it's bloody working. You know that? And it's what it is, it's not trying to tell the film, it's my, what I saw, what I did. What else do you want to know about Lou Reed? That's it. The thing about Iggy is, such a wild man on stage, like an animal. Interviewed by Nana in Berlin. Yeah. Yeah. This, is, this is for a national radio. First of all, welcome to Berlin, Nick. Oh, I love being in Berlin. I'm having a good time. I was born at the right time and I was in the right place. Yeah. But the interesting thing was I don't think I had a fucking clue at the time. Anyway, you were fun. I hope that way. You've got politics, you've got Berlin, you've got a bit of rock and roll. You know? Why do you call the book and the exhibition Blood and Glitter? I mean, oh, glitter well, is clear. Blood? Because I, because I bled for it. The characters. Yeah, no, it's the modern world, you know. <sighs> Never saw... The picture of him looking so so clear to my eyes. Well, know? because I had the thing is I had relationships. So that's why I can have get you, have some pictures. Have you had sex with him? No, with no, him? no, no. He's a very nice man, but he's the wrong sex. <laughs> my limited edition, beautiful books. The one I did with David Bowie, Queen, Tim <laughs> Farrer, and the one I'm doing with Lou Reed. Da hat er auch noch weitere Bücher, und die können Sie dann nachlesen. So I think maybe I was privileged to the, be yeah. the beginning of the synthesizing of the, of, of the postmodern uh, technological sensibility. I'll give you some photograph. Here we go. The Berliner Zeitung, that's the newspaper that's based here. The head is the Deutsche Guggenheim. How far away are we? Around the corner. That's the German collection with the Bohemian Rhapsody. Even though it's four guys, and even though it's this and that, and electronic flash and not, but they didn't have a clue about posing, where she was a master of the pose by the time she did Shanghai Express. <laughs> This is a great chance for us. We can finally share one of the most glamorous books we ever made with you. It is Blood and Glitter. I called you a big puff. That was all. I mean, you don't have to be gay to be a puff. I mean, you, you know, it's a state of mind. Uh, to, to move between the... It was really more about the appearance. So it's only about 45% pose, the other 50%. 45% pose, and the other 55% is more about... 55% yeah. yeah. uh, sind, that they see and help. And he also photographs only with it. Behave You want to talk about a documentary? Yes. But it was great. Berlin, to be able to write it from Berlin, you know? Right. It's like, it's like, no, it's Berlin. Berlin.